Hi guys, it's Mix here. Hope you're doing well. I hope you'll give my little throaty voice today. I've been really ill, like really ill. But we're gonna play some more Yandara Simulator. A bunch of you indicate stuff that I should be doing, so we're gonna try and do it today. Let's see what happens. What gender is your ideal lover, female? Sorry, that feature is not available yet. Soon though, I'm glad that they're adding that, it's really cool. I guess we'll have to go for male for now. <laughs> senpai can just be, actually we can custom away Senpai, can we now? Let's make him really pale. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> Beautiful. The perfect man, guys. <laughs> I can't feel anything. That's fine. For as long as I can remember, I've never been able to feel emotions. I pretend to be normal when I'm around other people, but on the inside, I feel nothing. <coughs> it's not as bad as it may sound. I know that I'm broken, but I don't care. This is normal this for is me. This is some fucked up dark shit, awesome. But everything changed when I met him. He suddenly fell alive. My senpai. Beautiful. For the first time I felt something. A strong desire. A longing. A yearning. A craving. Wonderful. Now I finally understand what it means to be human. To be alive. Senpai I'm changed everything. I'm to the way he makes me feel. I don't care about anything else. Maybe we should kill all of them. He is everything to me. And now, someone is trying to take him from me. I guess they all need to fucking die then, don't they? She wants him, but not in the same way that I want him. She could never appreciate him the way I do. She doesn't deserve him. He belongs to me alone. A right and healthy attitude, guys. She has taught me a new emotion. Rage. Oh, yeah. I want to stop Guess we her. need to. I want to hurt her. All valid points. I want to kill her. Yeah, especially that last one. There is nothing I won't do for Senpai. I won't let anyone come between us. I don't care what I have to do. I don't care who I have oh, to hurt. she's really, really into this guy. I don't care whose blood I have to spill. I won't let anyone take him from me. Nothing else matters. No one else matters. Senpai will be mine. Perfect. He doesn't. Have a choice. That's a really good intro. I haven't seen that before, so that's pretty awesome. They really kind of things coming together, aren't they? Think about when we first played this. Hey. Okay. Do I know you? I saw you stalking an upperclassman today. Do you have a problem with that? No. I wanted to give you some information about the girl he was with. Her name is Osana Najimi. Osana Najimi. She needs to fucking die! She has a crush on him. She believes in a myth about the cherry tree behind the school. The myth that if you confess your love to someone underneath that tree on a Friday, they are guaranteed to accept your confession? Correct. She's planning to confess to him next so Friday. So we have a week to stop our target. Why are you telling me this? I would be happy if something bad happened to Osana-chan. I think you might be the right person to give her what she deserves. Who are you? I'm the person nicknamed Infochan at school. I've heard rumors about you. You blackmail girls and sell panty shots to boys. Nobody knows your real name. The rumors are true. This is kind of weird and very dark. If you ever need a favor, text me a panty shot and I'll give you whatever support uh, so I can. Ah, so she's the one on the phone that identifies things for you? If you want to know personal information about anyone at our school, just send me a photograph of their face and I'll tell you everything I know about them. You're disgusting. You're a stalker. 
If you want my help, text me. If you don't care, ignore me. You have one week until your precious senpai belongs to Osana-chan. I hope you make her suffer. That's really fucked up and really fucking awesome. Holy shit, I like that a lot. Let's try, shall we? Let's see if we can do some killing today. <coughs> okay, so we're gonna... I've got some, like, vague ideas of what I want to do, so we're gonna try a few things out. Just wanted to arm ourselves with a knife, because, uh... We have some things that need to be done. We're heading up to the roof, guys, because, well, you'll see. And we put it over her here. <laughs> there we go. Did someone really just throw water on me? Why would someone do this? I can't go to class like this. I need to change my clothes. So we emptied a bucket of water over the girl down there, which a lot of you wanted me to do. And she's now going to change her clothes. And she goes into the gym block, all alone. All alone. No one else ever comes in here. No one else ever comes in here. Today, huh? Today, you stupid bitch! You think you can take Senpai away from me? You think you can do that, huh? <laughs> oh my god, that's fucked up! The fact that a large majority of you wanted me to kill somebody in the showers is, uh... Yeah. You are the guys with problems. You didn't enjoy that at all, did you, Gandara-chan? <laughs> See? She didn't enjoy it at all. Anyway. We'll leave her there. Actually, it's probably a bad idea, right? Because I'm going to get in trouble. Shit. Shit. Okay, change clothes. Knife away. Knife away. Knife away. Change clothes. Change clothes. Change clothes. Change. Change them. Uh, um, uh, this didn't go quite to plan. This didn't go quite to plan. Oh, here we go, here we go, bathe. Okay, we're all clean now. All clean, no one will suspect a thing. Ah, oh, here we go, gym uniform. Okay, brilliant. Almost there, guys. No one suspected a fucking thing. No one saw anything. No one suspected a fucking thing. Huh? Exactly. Exactly. And there we go. You saw nothing. You saw nothing! So, jumping ahead later in the week, a bunch of you wanted me to do this that I'm about to do now. And it turns out Purple Girl somehow survived being burned in a furnace. And um, I'm going to have to take some more drastic action yet again. Always the way. Always the uh, Yandare way, huh? So down here we have the toilets. And hopefully... We're going to be able to utilize a very interesting plan. Oh shit. Didn't mean to talk to you. Fuck off. Fuck off. Whoops, I missed the wrong button there, guys.
So we unscrew that, we pick up this, we come up here, and we soak up. <laughs> Did someone really just throw water on me? Why would someone do this? Ugh. I have to turn the stupid lights back Smart on. Smile for the camera! Where is it? <laughs> I think that's beautiful, right? Yeah, she's like, yeah, you need to make sure they're exactly at the center of the screen. Well, I thought that went really well. Look, she's smiling. She's smiling, guys. I'll fucking teach you, won't it, huh? That'll fucking teach you. See? She has no use for it. Can't even use it as porn. <laughs> anyway, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Yandare Simulator, guys. If you did, leave a like, a favourite, a comment. There will be more as there are more updates of the game. Stay tuned for more of it. <laughs>